Hi everyone, welcome back. Are we talking about another 300% up on this one or is it time for the cues and those plays related to them to come back down? Is it time to rotate and well, we'll say roll the dice against the big seven tech and try to make bank off of this. I'm gonna show you some plays out there for the swing traders and for those trying to play momentum. Man, there are some big things. Now, of course, uh, we discussed this in other videos. Folks, if you haven't done it, this is running out of time. 300% up. This is not what the, the movie's about today. The video is about today. But I did want to share C3AI rolling up with that AI stuff. You can get this share of stock for free right now. But you can only do it if you use my Moomoo link down below. Click it, put $100 in. You get a free share of that worth 40 something dollars, which is a 40 something percent return instantly, plus five more free shares of stock worth up to $2,000 a piece, plus a $100 cash reward coupon. Folks, this is one of the best deals you're ever going to see, and it is limited. It's running out of time. So, anybody 18 or older in the house can take advantage of it, and I do recommend it. And then, of course, Weeble, any any deposit using my link, a dollar, and you get up to 12 free shares of stock worth of 30600 But more importantly, folks, this is it. This is go time. Come on over to the Patreon. Check it out. See what we're going to be buying and selling this week. I got a lot of moves I'm getting ready for for Tuesday, the first day of the week. Uh, trading week. So I'm excited about that, but this is your opportunity. We got a private discord as well. So come on over and join us uh, and we'll see what's going to go on. Now, let's get into what I wanted to talk about today. The, you know, how, what is the big movers? Where can we try to take some risk? This video is not going to be your typical video. So let me just start out by saying this. If you're here, you want to see the best stocks to buy now, the best value stocks to buy now, the best dividend stocks to buy now. This isn't your video. This is not. This is for the high risk players. Today, I'm going to go over the highest risk moves I think anybody could take. And I'm not saying they're right or wrong, but I'm here to bring it to you as knowledge, as the old for those that don't know, I am Stockmo, an old financial educator and a financial advisor. Now I do this YouTube thing, but I want to teach you today about some of the most crazy moves in the stock market that you can make right now. And here's the deal. If you hit it, you're going to make bank. If you miss, you're probably going to lose it all. But I know there's a, a, a little niche out there that likes to uh, see some of these plays and wait till you see the numbers on these. It just blows your mind. Let's just start with the NASDAQ because a lot of the underlying stocks of these uh, plays I'm going to show you get into the NASDAQ. So the NASDAQ year to date, 31.6 up. Let's get out there. You can see uh, last year, over the last year, we got 2022. We got into 2022, started the year. This thing shrunk all the way down, almost 30% drop. Now, since then, we have recovered all the way up 30% back up, but not back to the highs. Some people saying we are going to get back to those highs. Others saying we are not. Now, I'm obviously in the boat that I did not think we would get back there, but my, my portfolio is set up for either way at this point. So I'm happy with what I got. Like I said, if you want to see what I'm doing, you can come on over to the Patreon. I feel very good about my positions, and I, do, I expect to make a substantial amount of money. But... We have to wait and see. Now, with this being said, and you can see, we've had pop-ups before where it comes back down like right here, and this thing crashed 20%, even though uh, you had this run, and everybody's like, oh, this is it, this is it. And I remember that in 2022, 20% up. It's a new bull market. Remember, a low up 20% makes a new bull market. And look what happened here. We got up 20%, which officially made a new bull market. And then we went down officially again 20%. That makes a new bear market. Now from there, we've gone up another 32%. And some people out there believe this is the end of this run. That it was too much, too quick. And with the Fed tightening and everything else, that it is time to lock in those gains and start hedging. Or for the risk takers, going the opposite. I'm not here to tell you what to do. I know everybody out there makes their own decision. Or does this thing keep running? We just don't know. But I did want to show you this. Now, we get into the cues. And this is be this is in the, the crazy stuff yet, folks. But we get into the cues and we have 40% up this year. Now, this is the NASDAQ 100. 
And I, I believe from some of the studies out there that around seven of them made up the bulk of the gains. And if you take those out, it would be nearly flat. And so the other 93 have not joined in yet. But could they join in? Possibly. But uh, right now, that's what you're seeing. So you're seeing stocks such as Apple just rolling up this year. Remember, they're almost a $3, uh, $3 trillion company, 50% up. You see Tesla doing its thing. How much is that up? Oh, uh, year to date, just a measly 141%. You see these big, big movers taking over. How's Meta doing? Did they do okay this year? Probably just a little bit, uh, 125%. So they're making up the bulk of moving these things. So the question becomes, are they overdone? Are they going to start pulling out? Now, this is a beautiful regression line. Just looks like it's not going to stop. Looks like it's just going to continue to make money and just keep rolling up. And that, hey, in another uh, couple of months, we'll be up to 350 or 300. You know, so where can we go for those who want the challenge? Those who want to risk and make a ton. Because I showed you individual stocks. But what about something that's a little bit more, um, we'll say, uh, diversified because it has more holdings? Not a lot, but more. Well, there's a stock I've talked about in the past, and I've been in this stock. I've been out of this stock. I've been all over this stock. But this is the beginning of this, this higher risk swing play for people who are looking. This is an ETF. It has underlying holdings. And let's check 3.68% uh, down on, on Friday. But check it out over the last five days. Still up 9.31, right? Not bad. What's Mo, this doesn't seem like a crazy stock. Oh, folks, wait till you get to year to date. 363%. Just remember, this thing has a few stocks under it to give us some diversification. And it's up 363%. Decay in there. Everything in there it's still rolling up. Is it too much? Is it going to go up another 300%? Now, you said, Mo, you, you told us that you were going to give us the craziest of the crazy. You can buy options on these folks. What do you think they're up? And that's when we start talking about thousands of percent. So for those risk takers out there that are like, yo, I, wanna, I want the most extreme way to possibly make money. Right or wrong, I'm not here to tell you which direction to go, but you can get into these kind of plays with options to try to score that huge gain I know a lot of people are trying to do. Now, I'm not doing that. I'm telling you that right up front. I'm looking at value plays, bonds, and I do get into some of my triple leverage uh, treasury plays and stuff like that. But I am watching this one because let's just be honest. This market is crazy. Could it continue to run? Absolutely. Look at the year, though. This thing had a high uh, around 118. Now we're up to 190 over the last year. Uh, five year, though, we're not even close to where we were. We were at 475. So when I look at this and people say, well, is it over? Well, it could go all the way back up to 475, 476. We don't know. You just don't know what's going to happen. The money's flowing. They got the debt ceiling done. They're printing money down in D.C. again. The Fed paused. It seems like enough has been done that this could continue a little bit until, in my opinion, and I'm watching for this, once you get the student loan forgiveness or whatever you want to call it, the pause, the pause done, and people have to start putting that money back into student loans, that's going to take hundreds of billions of dollars out of the economy over a two-year period, just like it put it in. I think it was almost $300 billion was saved from people having to pay their student loans and they used it on the economy. Now they have to pay the student loans again. And so that now becomes an issue because now that's not going towards goods and services. It's going towards the student loans. And so I think this is going to change, obviously, because that's a huge stimulus. That's a huge stimulus. That's, a, that's like a stimulus package in itself is the student loans. You got the government spending record amounts of money. That's like a stimulus. You had stimulus checks at one point. All these things were happening, and that's what gave us the run. And, of course, we had a major, major downturn. Look at this thing. 90% uh, down. From there, up 340% off those lows. Now, I showed you that. This is FNGU, if you wanted to go long. On this triple leverage, the tech plays, a lot of people don't know about this. And they're like, wow, I never even heard of this play. If you have, let me know. Have you tried it? Have you done anything? But 
that's for the bulls. This is for the bulls. You can buy, or you can even buy some put options out there if you wanted to do it that way. But there is opportunity, right? So that's not the only one. So we come in here and we take a look at QQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQQ
because uh, that's the kind of stuff I like to bring to you as an old teacher. And like, of course, like I said, get that C3 AI from Moo Moo down below. You got to use the link. If you don't use it, you don't get it. Uh, and of course, come on over to the Patreon. I appreciate you stopping by. Let's get out there and make some money.